Now here is a DIY on the fly. These gentlemen building themselves a chimney. At the base, some cement and mortar, these relatively lightweight prefab clay bricks, and some thin rebar reinforcement. To this point, stuck at the base and to the wall at the bottom of the construction. Now though, a channel running from a heater inside. This can be hooked up from inside or outside, however. An opening to be used for cooking attached out front. Around the back, the outlet from indoors is inserted. A little more mortar to be sealed up and plastered later, thrown in. Once that's done, it's on to continuing this chimney stack and it gets impressively tall. After a cutout to get around the piping, the stacking comes more quickly, one after the other. And this isn't stopping at the second floor, it's going straight through that temporary roof. Now to anchor it to the wall in sections, an important part of the process ensuring these bricks don't fall. They're not that heavy. Nonetheless, stability is key. A little bit more mortar, a little bit more of that rebar, and the next brick is slid down. From there, just a matter of cleaning up the edging. And slowly but surely, these gentlemen are a little bit closer to a little barbecue with the smoke directed away and a little heating just in time for the colder season without worrying about turning on those smoke detectors. A little more wire to wrap the rebar and this is finally breaking through the ceiling and the roof. And for the roof, some special equipment is going to be needed. Fortunately, pretty easy to lay the last few bricks from the balcony on the second floor. A little more rebar and now time to start thinking about the final extension. The sun going down, it's got to get done quickly or tomorrow. A few last bricks and the decision to get up on the roof and cut a space through the temporary ceiling. First prepared with a few holes from the drill before the big boy comes in with a chainsaw. The drill used to make marks to guide the cut lines. An angle grinder even used to clean those sections up before it looks like they were perfectly measured. A few pieces at a time in an awesome human chain sent up to the roof, fixed into place, and it's just about time to start sending smoke signals up to say it's done. With that last brick and scoop of mortar, chimney complete. Now to start cooking. <laughs>